Hello, I'm Dr. Matthew Davis and this is Dr. Brian Hammer and we're with Crossroads Chiropractic and today we're going to talk to you about a very important uh, topic which is pregnancy and also pediatric chiropractic care. And we have four questions today that commonly come up that people ask us that we want to kind of go over. And number one is it is it safe for mom and is it safe for baby? And then the third question is uh, what are the different techniques or do you use a different technique? And then uh, kind of I think a really important question is does, how would I know if my baby needs chiropractic care? So, Dr. Brian, how would we start that off? Nice, and those are all really good questions, and they're common questions that come into the office on a daily basis. And to start off with the safety, is it safe for the mom to get adjusted with, while she's pregnant? And the answer is yes, it's completely safe. And a lot of the questions, the concerns come from, well, what about the baby? I can't lay down, I can't lay face down. Are you gonna adjust me the same as everybody else? And the answer to those questions is, no, we're not gonna adjust you the same as everybody else, but it's still gonna be extremely effective. So what we do is we have you lay face down on the table, but our tables are designed for pregnant mothers to have a pelvic drop piece that comes down so there's no pressure on the stomach by any means. Also, is it safe for my baby to get adjusted once it's born? That, it, it is very safe. And it's safe because we don't use near the, amu the amount of pressure that we do on an adult spine as we do on a child. With a child, what we do is we use fingertip pressure just as much pressure to check the ripeness of a tomato. So if you could imagine that and how gentle it is, but very specific at the same time. So while the mother could be worried about the safety of the baby, we guide them along the way with different steps to show them that it is safe and effective. Sometimes on TV you'll see sitcoms or movies that show chiropractors kind of turning and twisting. We, we don't use those techniques a lot of times in the office and then a lot of with babies we, we, we use just our fingertips, just a little bit of pressure, just a little bit of pressure on a specific area, almost like a vibration kind of that you can feel back from the baby when they do need uh, an adjustment. And so I always recommend the earliest, you know, as, as, as soon as you can get them here to have us check, not necessarily adjusted, but check to see if there's any spinal, uh, any nervous system interference, any pinched nerves. And, and if there is, as we correct that, there'll be a lot of good stuff that'll happen on that baby to reach their, their, their maximum potential of their health. And so um, the last question is, kind of why would a baby need to be adjusted it's a perfect little package why, why, why do we need to mess with that and so how we kind of talk about that or how we address that is well think about it with our world everybody's getting sicker and sicker like adult things like diabetes are now uh, are now kids are getting th th these diseases and these health care problems that adults used to have so we're having more and more illnesses and so with babies a lot of times we'll find that pinched nerves a lot of times cause like colicky problems or other bowel or GI issues um, allergy stuff skin stuff sleeping crying mm -hmm. uh, all types of things like that so we're not saying we can cure these things but what we're saying is hey if you're if you have a baby and and she and he or she's having problems or even before she has problems bring her in let us check her check him or her for the nervous system the integrity look and what we look at is we look at like their leg length we look at how their little hips move and, and and the height of them and we look at their little heads and as we look at them we, we hold them up or we have them sitting in a chair we look at if their heads shifted to one side or other other and that's one thing that you guys can look at from home to know whether your baby might, might need to be checked or not when you're looking in the back seat you see their head tilted to one side or the other all the time mm -hmm. um, that's a sign that you might need to bring them in and take us take a look at them but we are very proficient um, and experienced with working with kids uh, we love it in fact we you know the reason why we come to work is to work with the kids it's just you know, that we uh, the adults are a lot of fun to work with too we come here to work with the kids and and the bonus is to be able to work with their families and and their parents so um, Anything else, Doc? Yeah, and just like Dr. Matt said, it's just so important to get your kid checked right off the bat because it's, it's preventative care. Right now, we're stuck in that sickness type care. We don't go be preventative until something happens, and sometimes it can honestly be too late. So when they're young, get them checked at least. After the trauma through birth, coming out and entering the world, it's never a bad idea to at least get your spine checked. And, and, and that's where it starts is as a kid. Healthy kids grow up to be healthy adults, and that's, and that's our goal for every kid in the community. I agree and you know with, with, like we say a lot of the problems that we find in adults have been created kind of like what he said been created from a kid so when you fall off that bike when you're learning to walk and you fall on your butt um, those things are the things that uh, will cause problems and linger and then later on in life we we fix the broken down adults which we don't mind doing but we'd rather catch it up the <laughs> change just a little there so again I'm dr. Matthew Davis this is dr. Brian Hammer we're Crossroads Chiropractic. If you, you know, the number on the screen, if you have any other questions, just give us a call. 
Uh, our address is 3339 Highway 34 East, Suite C, as in Charlie, Sharpsburg, Georgia. So uh, we'd love to see you, help you with any of your health care goals, and, uh, but have a great day. Look forward to helping you.